Diabetics are more susceptible to eye diseases because diabetes is a disease that affects blood vessels and blood vessels are present in the eye, namely in the retina. When these retinal vessels get damaged from diabetes, they leak fluid. They can also leak fat molecules and red blood cells. This leakage of material can cause permanent damage to the retina with subsequent loss of vision. If these problems are not taken care of in a timely fashion, a person can be left with poor vision or even blindness. There are different types of diabetic eye diseases. Basically, non-proliferative and proliferative diabetic retinopathy. Non-proliferative diabetic retinopathy are changes in the retina in diabetics that have to do with leakage of fluid, fat molecules, and blood into the thickness of the retina. Whereas proliferative diabetic retinopathy has to do with the growth of new blood vessels called neovascularization that can actually break, bleed, and fill up the eye with blood. This will eventually cause what's called tractional retinal detachment and eventual blindness. It's very important for a diabetic to maintain regular eye exams. This is for the following reason. Diabetes inside the eye is progressive. If a patient has an eye exam on January 1st and starts developing diabetic changes in the retina on March 1st, if a patient is seen again the following January 1st, then the diabetic changes only had nine months to progress. However, if a patient waits three years for the next eye exam, then the diabetes would have progressed two years and nine months, which at that time could very well lead to catastrophic and irreversible changes in vision and even blindness. At the Eye Associates of Brazos Valley, the physicians and the surgeons have been trained in diagnosing and treating retinopathy for decades. I personally myself have treated thousands of diabetics before I even finished training in 1994 and have treated thousands of diabetics since. So we at the Eye Associates of Brazos Valley have the expertise, the diagnostic equipment, and the treatment to be able to take care of diabetics right here in this office.